everyone. So I have a yard sale haul to do. Um, I went yard sailing today and it was probably the coldest outside it has been in a while. Um, I found some things but I froze my butt off getting them. But I'm going to show you guys what I found and I'm not going to start any kind of order. Some things my mom actually picked up for me so if I um, grab that item I will tell you if you know she got it for me or not. But I think I found a lot of good things, um, even though it was really cold outside. So the first thing that I got was this fossil wallet. And this is just a brown, um, brown wallet, but it's in brand new condition. It smells like leather because that's what it's made out of. But the inside, it seriously looks, it seriously looks brand new. So... I got this for, she had it priced at $12, but then um, marked it down to 6 So I paid $6 for that, which, you know, I think is worth it because it is a really nice wallet and is new. Um, my mom got this coach bag for me, and this one is vintage. This is a vintage coach bag. It's just small. Um, inside looks like that not not even worth looking on the inside no um, my mom paid six dollars for this and she got it at the same sale um, that I got the fossil wallet at so she got me that um, also at the same sale my mom got me this wallet because she had gone the day prior she went on Friday and I didn't get to go until Saturday. But this is a Clark's wallet, and I have never owned any kind of accessory or um, anything like that from the brand Clark's. I've only ever seen their shoes and stuff like that. But this is brand new as well, and it's just really pretty wallet. The inside kind of has a florally kind of has a florally print and she paid a dollar fifty for this so that's a really great deal for um, a nice wallet so got that I'm probably boring you guys with wallets but this is another one my mom picked up for me from the same sale another fossil wallet this one is just black and it's kind of like a um, like a billfold that just snaps open and Again, in new condition, this one she paid a dollar for. So a dollar for Fossil, I think, is just amazing. So got those. Um, I got these shoes, and if you recall, you might have seen these shoes in a um, thrifting video I have done. I got these same shoes at the thrift store same exact pair in pretty much the same exact condition, same size, same everything. These are by the brand Indigo, which is made by Clarks. And um, at the thrift store, I paid $7.99 for these. At the yard sale, I paid $3. And I just sold the same pair for like 30 something. So when I saw them, I just had to get them since um, the other pair did so well. So got those for $3. Um, my mom found me a couple makeup related items. She knows I'm obsessed with beauty products. So she got me this lotion by a brand called Way East. I had never heard of this. I've seen it before at yard sales, but never actually owned anything by it. It's just called a healthy balance body lotion. It was a dollar and that is still sealed. Um, she also got me these serious skincare lip gloss and this was a dollar still in the box um, again I see this brand I see this brand a lot <clears throat> at yard sales but let me open it up so I can show you guys the color this is actually purple it's in the or in the name the name is called juicy and it is a purple lip gloss so that's interesting interesting shade 
So she got me that. And then this is a same brand, Serious Skincare. This is a lipstick. And she also paid a dollar for this as well. And I will open it, show you guys the color, because I don't know what the color is either. Oh, it's still sealed, so I'm not quite sure what the color is. But the shade is called Day Lily. So. Not sure about that one yet. Um, I found this um, toy for 50 cents. I bought this for my dog. It's a baby toy. It's by the brand Carter's. Um, I have a very small dog. She's a Shih Tzu. And typically when I'm at yard sales, the baby toys, if they have squeakers in them or that crunchy material, she loves those and they're just the perfect size for her. So I got that for her. So if you have a small dog, it's worth checking in the baby um, section for your pet. Um, I found this Bath & Body Works Winter Candy Apple Body Spray. And this was 50 cents. Um, got that. Um, I found these. These are brand new. They're called Style Sticks by Luxor Pro. And they're basically just curlers for your hair. Um, they're still sealed. I paid 50 cents for them, so I don't know how well they're going to work or anything like that, but got those. I got a, this is from Bath & Body Works. It's a Slatkin & Company candle in the scent Hydrangea, Hydrangea, how do you pronounce that? Hydrangea? Let me see. Hydrangea. 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 That's how I've ever, that's what I've always called it. Hydrangea. 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 Like it's a flower. I know it's a flower, but I didn't know oh. how to pronounce it. Here you go. Well, anyway, it was from Bath & Body Works by the Slatkin & Company brand. I paid $1 for it, and it's in this really cute jar that has what I'm assuming are hydrangeas um, all around it. <laughs> what? Hydrangea. Hydrangea. Hydrangea flowers, um, but it is brand new, never been burned. These retailed for nine fifty, so the dollar can't beat that. I like Bath and Body Works candles. Um, I got this J R Watkins hand and body lotion. I just love the packaging of this. This was one dollar. It's in the scent grapefruit. It smells really good. Not like I need more lotion, but you know, for a dollar. Can't beat it. Um, I also found this Bath and Body Works Winter Candy Apple um, Shimmering Perfume. Shimmer Perfume? I have never liked this before, but it's just a roll-on um, perfume in the scent Winter Candy Apple. I paid 25 cents for it. it. Smells very good. I love that scent. So, got that. Um, I only found one clothing piece. I typically don't really, I'm not in the mood to look at clothing when I'm yard sailing, which is a shame because I'm sure I passed by a lot of cute clothes, but I did find this top that I thought was cute. It's just by Rue 21, and it's just a florally coral colored um, tank top. At least I'm assuming it's a tank top. I mean, if this is a dress, then I feel bad for today's youth, but um, I'm pretty sure it's a tank top. Do you think this is a tank top? This cannot be a dress. I think that is a dress. You think this is a dress? Oh my god, how short would that be? My butt cheeks would be sticking out the bottom. I don't know. Is it like a long top? I don't know. Maybe tank. it's a tunicky tank top. I don't know. I cannot wear this as a dress. Oh my god, I'd be arrested. <laughs> or picked up by someone looking for a hooker. But anyway, I paid a dollar for this, so I thought that was a good deal as long as it fits okay. Um, I found a bottle of perfume. This is but this is Burberry. It's called Weekend. It's just a little teeny tiny baby bottle, one fluid ounce, but I paid five dollars for it. It looked new and it smells really nice, so I thought it was worth five dollars. I mean, it's way more than that in the store. I got two of these things and I thought these were neat and I didn't even know what was in them until my boyfriend opened it up because it was kind of like this in this black case. And it is by the brand T3 by Bespoke Labs. And it's basically a hair stylist kind of like comb set.
set. It has all different combs in it. And I just thought this was pretty awesome. I paid $2 for it. So, it just has, like, all different hairstyling combs in. Like, I don't know if they have, like, names or anything like that. But, and it comes in this cute little case. And then I also got this same one, but this one's sealed. But I also paid $2 for it. So I just thought this was a really good deal. Um, the combs that are in it are the large styling comb, fine cutting, large cutting, large dressing, all-purpose cutting, and the rat tail combs. So you get the whole um, set. For two bucks. I mean, that's great for anyone who's a hairstylist, or even if you're not. So, I got that. I found this bottle of Spiritual, if I'm pronouncing that right, um, Multitasker Base and Top Coat Nail Polish. This is just for as a base coat or top coat. I paid a dollar for it. I know they sell this brand at um, Ulta, and I'm sure it's, it retails more than a dollar. So, I got it to try it out. Because my nails are always chipping because I have, I, I don't um, have a top coat to put on. So I figured I would get that. So I have a top coat now. Um, I got this Lipstick Queen Lip Gloss. This was still in the box. It's called Lipstick Queen Jean Queen. And she had $2 on this, but um, it was at the same yard sale I got all of the wallets and stuff from. So she let me have it for a buck since I was buying so much other stuff from her. And it just looks like this. It's just a, um, I don't know what kind of shade you want to call that. But it's cute and <clears throat> it was new. So I got that for a dollar. And then the last thing that I got, um, or no, I got this bottle of caviar rapid repair um, spray for instant shine and moisture for your hair this was one dollar and so I got that and then the last thing that I got I got from like someone who did the whole extreme couponing thing I always see them out at yard sales and typically I get some good deals from them so this lady had a bunch of um, dry shampoos and so I decided to get a couple I bought enough to make it um, two dollars worth of items but they were these Pantene on the go blowout extend dry shampoos and these were 50 cents a piece so I got three of those and then um, I also saw this one which is the Garnier Fructis volume extend instant modifier dry shampoo so that was also 50 cents so I got all of those for two bucks and then I also found something else I forgot. Um, this was just a bracelet I found for 25 cents. And when I first saw it, I thought these were leaves. But now that I'm looking at it, I, I don't know why I thought they were leaves. Because they're obviously not leaves. But um, it's signed Trafari. So I'm thinking it's like a vintage um, piece of costume jewelry. But it's just like gold. Um, which I thought they were leaves. But they're not leaves. At least I don't think they're leaves. But I saw leaves when I looked at it. But anyway, that was just 25 cents. So um, that is all for my yard sale haul. Um, I didn't end up getting any kind of frostbite, which is nice. I can't believe how freaking cold it was. My face was red. It was 37 degrees out, and my nose was running, and it, I've never yard sailed in weather that cold before. So it kind of was bad in the sense that I think a lot of people weren't bothering having their yard sales because yeah, I don't think a lot of people bothered having their yard sale because it was too cold and like it, every yard sale I was going to like it was just me and my boyfriend like no one else was around which was kind of weird it just felt like we were the only two people out but probably because we were because we were crazy but I think I got a lot of good deals and it was worth it for what I found so I hope you guys liked the video and I will see you next time.